Right, so uh, last week I did uh, quite well at the Blackpool Regional. Um, I went, I won five and I drew two, so I went undefeated uh, with uh, the Wanderers deck, and I got this amazing, amazing play match deck with uh, Steel. Um, so I'll just go over my deck profile. I know I've not posted on the channel for a while, but hopefully this will show you how amazing this deck really is, uh, especially because it's sneak peek today. So um, I'll be doing a new profile when I top with that deck. Uh, so in the main deck, uh, I'll just go get straight into it. So I've got, um, I've got three of the Rubina and three. Uh, Eaglen, so again your search is really really good, um, you have to play three of each, uh, then I just play uh, two of the Stree and one Tokan, uh, Stree mainly for uh, DPE, banishes it, uh, can get rid of some annoying cards from your opponent as well, uh, can empty your grave for shifter if you need to, and then Tokan just to keep the recursion going, uh, because there comes a point where you can't search anymore, so I just get your cards from the banish pile. Uh, then for my my special tech choices. I've got um, Fire Statue, really, really good. Stops your opponent from doing anything, really, in terms of summoning. Uh, I've got the M Pen, obviously, uh, the boss monster, allows you to search and uh, stops all link decks. It's really good against Tribal Gate. Um, I've got my Rise of the Mega Monarch, again, stacks your opponent's deck if you need to. Uh, and then the final card is uh, Avion. And that's just the negate. So uh, these are the big ones I search off Eaglen. And these this, this the small one that I get uh, off uh, Rubina. So again, really, really good. Um, Ryzen did quite a lot. You know, it can put your D shifter back on top of your deck, and then you can activate it again the next turn, and then you just rinse and repeat until you beat them down. Because that's the issue of this deck; it takes time to kill your opponent. Uh, but hopefully, they scoop before that, uh, which is partially why I drew as well. Um, for hand traps, I played only two Ash because I wanted to keep it to forty, um, and I couldn't find anything else I would want to take out. Uh, and then D Shifter. Uh, this is really, really good, but I didn't use it as often as I wanted to. Um, I only used it twice. Both times when I did it, it wouldn't be the game, so it's definitely one of the more broken cards. Um, so, yeah, these were the main deck uh, monster hand traps. Moving on to spells uh, draw power, I had three extra and three duality. I put the extra over prosperity because prosperity doesn't get you more cards, uh, you need more resources in this deck to just keep on grinding. Uh, Prosperity might give you the one card, but then if they draw you, then you don't have enough uh, gas to keep going. Uh, duality, again, really good. You don't have really special summon, and you'll find out why in a second as well. Um, then, obviously, the three field spell on the terraforming. Again, like gives you an extra normal summon. Um, gets you your resources. It's almost like a rota almost, so really, really powerful. And you get to normal summon in your opponent's turn, and that's what the deck does, essentially. Uh, just the one uh, wins, uh, because, again, it's searchable, um, it lets you you know, mulligan so you can draw your actual good cards and get rid of your high level monsters. Um, it's also really good because it gets rid of problematic monsters, you can get rid of your opponent's uh, you know, DPE with it and they can't get it back because it tributes over it. So again, really really good cards, like Stormforth on legs, so it's really really good. Uh, some defensive cards I played was uh, Two Book of Moon. Again, it dodges in perm, it dodges Vela. Uh, doesn't dodge Ash, unfortunately. Um, but again, you know, if you Book of Moon any of their negates, and it acts as a chalice almost. Um, so again, really, really good card there. Especially Chi Xiao, because in Sword Soul it's an annoying card to get over. Um, then I played uh, two Cross Out and one Cold Bite. Now, the reason I played these cards, well, because I only own two Cross Outs, but uh, Cold Bite, again, really, really good versus Droll, Lancia, Ash, Vela, you can name it, even DPE. Um, cross Out, because I found out in my previous two regionals I was losing a lot to Droll, I was losing to Ash just because that I can't play through that quite well. Uh, so, because I play Ash and, and Droll in the side deck, you'll see in second, uh, it's really, really good to get rid of those annoying cards. And uh, interesting in the mirror as well. <laughs> very, very interesting in the mirror. Uh, then the final spell uh, was Duster, because I, I hate back, back row decks playing against them with this deck, so really, really good. Um, finally, for the traps, I did play 3 Imperm again. It's a good cross out target, it's a good card overall. Uh, baits out the gates, like a chalice almost. Um, not much to say there. And then finally, I played uh, the Fuandri, Dreaming Town. Again, it's an extra normal summon in your opponent's turn. It's a Book of Eclipse uh, during your opponent's turn as well. So again, if they try and go for you know, something that could attack over the Barrier Statue, you can just Book of Moon their monsters. So again, really, really powerful. And the final card, Punishment. That was all right. <laughs> it didn't really, it didn't really come up, uh, but it, it can come up, and I'll show you my extra deck, and then you'll understand how. Um, 
So for the extra deck, uh, first of all, represent. Uh, so I had my tokens as I do inside. But in the extra deck, I played uh, Triple Entus. Again, sends it off punishment. People tried to use Maximus a lot over the weekend as well against me, and it's it's really good. I, I sent two off and destroyed his whole field. Um, <laughs> it's pretty good. Uh, I'll talk about my match -ups, my match -ups in a second. Um, played two, uh, three Ferrigit because I technically can make it if I need to. I never needed to, uh, but also again sending it with punishment to just sort out my hand because the deck does brick. Unfortunately, that's how it works. Um, played three Shireg again. It's a searcher, so because all the uh, all the, the ones who banish themselves, I can always just send this with punishment and then search whatever I'm, I'm missing, whichever piece I'm missing. So that was quite good. Um, I played two Nightingale, uh, two Downward, and two Zeus, so it's just the Zeus package. Um, and it actually came up because, uh, well, again, when I go through my matchups, I'll, I'll let you know why. So, again, really, really solid. I wouldn't change anything in the, in the extra deck. Now for the side deck, and this is probably one of the weirdest side decks you'll ever see. So I'll play one draw. <laughs> Because I have enough hand traps, my shifter is powerful, pow like powerful enough. I can't activate this on the shifter anyway, and that's actually why shifter is good because my opponent can't activate this either because that's sent to grave for cost. Um, so I side this mostly for the cross out. If I draw it, it's still good against my opponent, but uh, mainly cross out target. Um, I played. I tried this out. I played two token collector, um, and that was mo mostly for sword soul because that's the only deck I lose against really, and it worked. I used it at final round and, and it worked and it wouldn't be the game, so we'll definitely carry on playing this card. Uh, then we have uh, two twin. Again, ratios are a bit weird, but just I, I want to fit as many cards in here as possible because I can, like I said, I, I've got a lot of draw power, I've got dualities, I've got cards that can get to get me to my cards. Uh, twin twister because back row decks are a thing. I lose to the deck can be only one. I lose to goals in match. Uh, any floodgate, floodgate apart from rivalry really hurts me. So uh, someone limits someone. Someone limited me. So again, so many cards to try and get rid of. Um, so yeah, really really good card. Uh, two econ. Never came up, but when I did use it at Leeds, it was really, really good. Uh, the one Lightning Storm, again, monsters, I don't like them. Back row, I don't like them. I don't like anything, so <laughs> really good to get rid of whatever's annoying. Uh, I did play the one on Ending Nightmare. This came up, actually, because uh, people are playing Mystic Mind. Um, and those decks are decks that play other field spells as well, so it actually came up against Prank Kids, and I just destroyed his field spell. I got, I got a game with that. Um, and again, you know, Mystic Mind is a card. And I can't keep on hoping that I draw my other out. Uh, so it's really, really good. Really good. I really enjoy it. Especially with the brave stuff as well. Get rid of the brave stuff as well. Um, final few cards. We have going first cards. Well, let's hope for going first cards. Obviously. I played one evenly. Again, just to get rid of some stuff. Um, so going first cards, I, made, I played uh, two D barrier. So good. So good. Really, really good card. Um, <laughs> just amazing. It's like a scythe almost for some decks. And finally, judgment because I know people are going to start siding in even these uh, back row removal. I need to try and get rid of anything that they try to get rid of, with like droplets, stuff like that. Um, dark rule no more because once, once I have a barrier statue, I don't want them to be getting rid of that kind of stuff. So that was uh, the whole deck. And I'll, I'll go through my matchups uh, in a bit of detail as well. So it was a seven round event with uh, 115 players. Uh, I came sixth, obviously, uh, but I did go undefeated. So uh, first match was against Tribe Brigade, Dogmatica, DPE. So that was where, when I summoned Pen, he couldn't do anything because his Link monsters do absolutely nothing against me. Um, that was also the, the game where I sent two enters and I defeated that. 2-0, uh, so it was quite quick. Round two was against Virtual World. It was a 1-1 because it was a very, very grindy game. Uh, game one, it ended up being, you know, the winner of that. Uh, game two, we were like 10 seconds from time and he summoned the uh, Black Moon monster and he burned me for 800, so I lost. Uh, not much I could have done there. Uh, round three was versus Eldritch and I actually 2 0 him. Because um, I summoned the barrier statue and they can't summon anything. They can't summon any of the light monsters. So yeah, that was that was literally yeah, that's why I lost. Uh, that, that's why I won. Sorry. Uh, game two actually, he uh, he killed himself with Imperial Order. So uh, that happens. Uh, <laughs> that was hilarious. Because he, he judgmented, I attacked him for a bit of damage. He burned himself the game, and that was fun. Um, round four was against Prank Kids. I did not enjoy that because he could have won the final round very quickly, but he wasted time, and that's why we drew. Um, happens. That was a 1-1. Uh, round 5, I won versus uh, PK Brave against JY Sharif. 
one of the you know, best players in the UK, I would say. Um, so follow him as well. Uh, but no, he's really you know, down to earth player. Really, really fun dueling against him. And uh, no, he, he gave me some good tips. I learned a lot more about the brave stuff from him as well when he's playing it. So uh, just a shout out to JY. Um, then round six was a mirror. And just one thing to say, cross our designator is really good in a mirror. Uh, that's what we what we do the game. Uh, round seven, final round was good sword soul. Uh, token collector with the, the game. Uh, and that's really it. Uh, just other shout outs uh, to again everyone who supported me, Team PGSC, you know, finally able to top after so long. Um, hopefully, get to do more live events, hopefully, get to top uh, with this deck again with the new cards, new support. Uh, and shout out to you know, Fanboy3, uh, again, everybody who was there, and uh, shout out to my family as well. So, thank you very much, uh, and hopefully, I'll give you the new list uh, as soon as I get the third copy of the quick list now. Thank you. <laughs>